Qualification 71 underway. The schedule gods dealt us an interesting one here. We have a blue alliance with some recognizable names and a red alliance ready to play spoiler. A lot of autonomous happening on the blue and red sides. High scores out of autonomous, 51 to 30. Drivers take control, smash and bash in the middle of the field. We have quick cycles going, all six robots quickly going to score. 87-49, that's Farmersville, one of the fastest machines here on the competition. 118, doing the Whirly Dervish around to get another cone. A lot of contact through the center. One, 148, 3,005 taking their lanes. Looks like the Blue Alliance is doing a lane strategy rather than a circular strategy with their cycles. Red Alliance quickly down, trying to score. 87-49, moving around their partner up over the charge station. Cube scoring for 87-49 with that excellent Cube intake. Big impact between 118 and 87-49. 118 around with the Cube. 3,005 capping another cone on the top. Their intake that they like to use in that community continuing to utilize. 148-118 scoring. All three blue robots going down to pick up some more. 148 twirling themselves on the barrier. Farmersville and 80, 83-70 continuing to score. 54-11 Robotowns going up with a cone. With 60 seconds remaining, we have a large blue lead. A lot of contact here in the middle. This is something we're going to start to get used to as the playoffs commence tomorrow. 54-11 down with the cube. 87-49 dropping their cube. 3,005 running. We have most items scored over here on the Red Alliance, or Blue Alliance, excuse me, with 30 seconds remaining, 118 and 148 lined up, 3,005 going to cap the last remaining scoring position, the Q bounces out, Red Alliance still scoring, they have scored all of the lower positions of their grids, with 13, 12, 11. 10 seconds remaining, blue robots going up, red robots, two are engaged, can blue get it, they're engaged, that's how it'll end, we'll see if we have broken the world high score here by the blue alliance.